Over in Rwanda, young Mushimimana Leonidas once faced a similar dilemma. My mother is in agriculture, so he don't have enough means for helping us. At that time, I struggled for paying the, the school fees at the university, at the same time looking how I can help my brothers and sisters. Due to the low level of local agricultural development, farming could only meet the family's basic needs. Despite these tough conditions, Leonidas managed to complete his university studies, but he couldn't find a suitable job, making his dream of improving his family's standard of living even more distant. Fortunately, the challenges faced by both the Chinese elder and the African youth were addressed by the same solution, Junsao, a hybrid grass developed by Chinese agricultural expert Professor Lin Zhanxi. In 2011, Professor Lin Zhanxi led a Junsao technology team to Rwanda to work on projects designed to combat soil erosion and preserve arable land. The team also introduced local farmers to the technique of cultivating mushrooms using Jun Cao. This method, which had previously helped many Chinese farmers escape poverty, offered new hope to Leonidas. I go back for looking at them, so I start to learn more about the technology. I start a business for producing mushroom using Jinko. After 10 years of hard work, Jun Cao has completely transformed Leonidas's life. We have a house to live. We have a transport means. We have our, our, my kids, my four daughters. Two of them, they are in secondary school now. Many farmers like Leonidas have now escaped poverty and started new fulfilling lives, all thanks to Jun Cao.